It's basically got to go in, Sam, I think. Yeah. Oh. <sighs> got your little golf outfit on. Puma hat. Got your little puma hat, lovely. Where is this guy? Ah, it must be him. Oh. For James? Yeah. Yes. Sweet. To Erinvale. Please, sir. Uh, I think 50, 52 minutes. 50, 52 minutes. Yeah. Alright, here we are at Erinvale Golf Club. This is meant to be one of the nicest golf courses. In Cape Town they've hosted, I think they've hosted DP World Tour events, they've definitely hosted Sunshine Tour events. I mean the back chops today, some of these holes are just going to be outrageous. Jacob, Jacob nice, James, nice to meet nice you. To meet you. Mm -hmm. So this is Jacob and this is Sam, he's invited me out here today, you remember here right? Indeed, nice. from the beginning of the year. Okay. I've heard this is one of the better courses around in the area. Is that yeah, right? Yeah, they hosted the World Cup of Golf 1996. Remember, Ernie, Ernie Els' team won. That's what ended up helping them host the President's Cup because then they thought, okay, it's a golf destination, we can come out. Nice. And You weren't yeah, born they, then, I'm guessing, right? No. How old are you? 19. 19! And then they Jeez. had two SA Opens here, 2003-2004. Oh, sweet. Both won by Trevor Immelman. Okay. Local boy, born just down the road. Yeah, he's the boy, isn't he? He's a good player. Don't talk us through the first hole because I've just got a random set of rental clubs which I'm going to show you in a minute, which is going to be quite entertaining. 410 meter par four, 90 degree dog leg right. Uh huh. You got to hit it over the dam basically and OB left. It's a tough, uh, tough introduction. Yeah. Is it driver? Yes. It is. Be. All right, cool. Sweet. Let's try and do this. We'll talk through these rental clubs in a minute. But this could be quite entertaining. Enjoyed Cape Town so far? Yeah, mate, it's amazing. It's beautiful. So much to do. Ah, oh, shot sound. Is that the line, yeah? That's perfect. <laughs> okay. For me, I'd be better. I like the way he says OV left, and I think I've got a left <laughs> machine in my hand right I now. I think so, with the. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I lost it. <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> I think it's in play. Yeah. I think you might have done me by about 30, but let's go. So the back nine, we've got a lot of these like back chops. We, yeah, you play up all the way up towards the mountain. Oh shit, really? You play with the vineyards to your right and then you come over the top and you look out towards the sea. Yeah, this Easy is... Uh, 50 on the number. 150. Probably into a little bit of 150 breeze. meters, and you you're down at sea level here, aren't you? So it's not like Joburg. So we've got a lot less. Yeah, less I've less got to start adjusting properly for it now. So 150, 165 yards. Usually that's like a nine iron, but I don't know with these power bats what that could be. What's in the bag coming? I'm taking that. Yeah. I'm happy with that. Yeah, you've seen one Egyptian goose so far, haven't you? You don't even need to go on safari tomorrow. Well, you've got David Attenborough with you the whole time. So you're oh privileged. God. You're very privileged. I you take a sh wait for the commentary. You take a sharp right. Yeah, you just whack it in the middle of the fairway. I've got to show them what's in my bag. You know what's in my bag. 
got a little what's in the bag while we're, uh, just before we hit our second shot into the par five, we've got the Callaway XR Speed with a 55 gram shaft, which is like a soft ladies. That's not misogynistic by the way, no. XR Speed three wood, hazardous. 5.5, 65 gram. So another little, another little softy. And then if you come in closer, we've got these irons, Callaway X series. I'm guessing they're regs. Uh, Uniflex, which means they're soft as f And this putter, Odyssey. I haven't seen one of these since I was a junior. I'm probably not gonna use the driver, but I will use the rest of it. 180 yards into this par five. Down the breeze. I'm gonna try and get this thing on the green. It's just normal to have a good short game if you're from South Africa, I think. Yeah, you all do. What are you putting for, son? What's up, bird? Wow. Brutal. <laughs> oh, just. Right, hole eight. Just, uh, just about to part. I haven't shown too much footage yet from this front nine, but the back nine. I've been told as we get up into the valley, there's some amazing views. Um, if you have a look at this, this is sort of, sort of what we've got coming up. So ninth hole going towards the clubhouse and then we go up the valley and then we're going to show you some golf footage. All right, hole nine. Let's get this one on camera. So we got three, is it 360 meters? 96 yards. Quick. Yeah. And it plays longer because Oh, it depends. Nine and eighteen. Both of the greens are fifty meters deep. So fifty meters. If the pin's at the front, it could let play three hundred and forty meters. If it's at the back, it'll play four hundred. Greenkeepers have got their work cut out here, right? Indeed. Poor bastards. So Paula Radcliffe. <laughs> That's an English joke. Is that going to be close? I don't know. Find out. No, you're fine. So what is that, the original sim? Yeah, it's the original sim. And that's the last good driver they've done. When was that, like three years ago? More. <laughs> really? Yeah. Yeah, I know. Now there's a camera in your face. It feels different, doesn't it? It's not blushing. So are you both? Do you say both from Joburg? No, I, I was. Yeah. You were from Joburg, and how long ago did you move down here? About nine years ago. Right, and life down here is <laughs> much better. Has <laughs> yeah. Joburg gone downhill a bit? Downhill, it's just you can do way more stuff here. Yeah. Yeah. The Definitely weather's security is a big, uh, a big thing for people in Joburg. Like. Got to stay, you want to stay preferably in a housing estate or whatnot. Otherwise, that's a big. But you have so. to, don't you? Yeah, it's a big. It's got to have an electric fence around it. But then the golf in Joburg is unreal. Yeah, for the weather. Yeah. For the yeah. But often they say no, the best golfers come from the Cape because they have to learn to play in the wind. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, we'd have Joburg because it's so elevated. The ball doesn't really doesn't get affected by the wind as much, does it? No. So you're from down here? Yeah, ten minutes up the road. Born and bred. Born here and stayed in the same house for like 16 years. And then we moved this year. Yeah. 200 meters down. <laughs> so it's very exciting. You've seen the world. Yeah. <laughs> and what's your plans? What's your plans after your. You're having a gap year, you're calling it? Gap year. A year so off to play golf? Basically. I'm coaching cricket and hockey at a primary school. It's been okay. A lot of fun. Nice. But next year, I'm going to start at Stella Bosch. Okay. Business. Investment management. Oh, but right. I really like to Smart the guy golf. then. <laughs> <laughs> so, what are you 
playing off now. I'm plus one. Yeah. Plus one. Yeah. Decent. And your home course is Even just though, down yeah. the corner. Much shorter. Yeah. But, but hour away. So. An hour away. No, oh, 45 minutes. Depends on traffic. Okay, and what's your plan? You're going to do PGA, PGA in South Africa? Year, yeah, I'm going to do that. Then it's a three year diploma. And then after that, I'll see where it goes. What, what are you thinking? Golf? Or? I'm going to try, but not, not sure. You've got okay. to be really good to go pro. So, you do. Yeah. But and if not, coaching. I enjoy coaching. You and do it, you do, right. Okay. And Jacob won the club champs at Devonville this year. I wasn't going to say that. He's a modest yeah. guy. Let's <laughs> see. <laughs> what do you want? Right, what's the score of the match? We need to talk about that out. Oh, I'm like 6 down. <laughs> I think I'm 2 up on you, James. Okay. After 9. So right. he's, James was kind on the front line. Gave me a couple of shots. Yeah. I'm going to use your clubs on the back line. Yeah, definitely. Jump back with us. <laughs> She gave me a chachri, curry to go to the doba doba. Sun beating off the derrick. <laughs> I know. Uh, where is this wing going? It's in off the left, isn't it? Sorry. <laughs> uh, right, seven iron. That might not be enough. To me, that's a lot of wind. <laughs> the f Thanks. <laughs> oh, yeah. Got two, mm, two thirty yards downhill. It's not even into wind, not even downwind. It's gonna be all of a four iron melted. God, that's rough. That's thick. What's thick mean? That rough just can't get through it. I walk the grass. Yeah, it's so. Gosh. Right, 48 meters, oh, 55 uphill. Little soft sandwich. Oh, this thing just flies right. Got away with that. Just through the brake. It's basically got to go in, Sam, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Tiger Woods here. Jesus. Oh. This is Sam to potentially win the match. Does he hold another? Oh. oh. Ooh. <laughs> Putt to win. Go on, mate, roll it in. Oh, he's succumbed to the pressure. 
Yeah, that's fine. Is this okay? Okay. Oh, game's still alive. Got a gel there. Too far left? Gone. No. <laughs> to be fair, I thought that was gone as well. So where's your second shot? Are you are you in on the green? So they're still alive. Okay. The match lives on. All right, Sam Faverdi. Currently dormy. Let's to close it out. Oh, has he done it? Oh, oh, one of those. Oh, it's just straightened up. Hey, you got another putt to win. Carl, let's not go two for two fails here. It's not like it's on YouTube, mate. On to the next, I'll give you that one. Yeah. Uh -huh.